Ken Delanian is with us now. He's our uh, justice and intelligence correspondent. Ken, you've been going through this report as well since it dropped just moments ago. What, what are you learning? So the names that stand out to me of people they recommended charges again but who haven't been indicted would include Cleta Mitchell, a prominent Republican lawyer who's been the subject of a lot of press coverage around efforts to overturn the election but hasn't been charged. Mike Flynn, the former national security advisor to President Trump, who famously uh, was uh, pleaded guilty to lying to the FBI and was then pardoned and has become a, a you know, a, a almost iconic figure in terms of efforts to overturn the election and to claim fraud in the election. Um, and Boris Epstein, mm. uh, one of Donald Trump's um, you know, most senior consigliers and lawyers uh, who has not been charged. So uh, uh, again, as Lisa said, uh, this document does not explain the basis for including the names of these people. It doesn't detail the potential charges against them. And we have no idea what the decision making was behind the uh, the DA's uh, decision not to bring those charges against the individuals who were named but not charged. But it's uh, significant nonetheless, and it's going to become, uh, you know, something that we're all going to chew on and talk about for uh, for some time to come.